let's take an imaginary trip through the solar system to see how Earth looks from various other places in our own neighborhood of space. Spacecrafts exploring our solar system have given us some marvelous views of Earth. First, imagine blasting off and being about 200 miles above Earth's surface. That's about the height of the orbit of the International Space Station. From the window of IS, the surface of the Earth looms large. In the daytime, you can clearly see major landforms. At night, from Earth orbit, you see the lights of Earth's cities. Let's get farther away, say, the distance of the orbit of the Moon. As we pass the Moon some quarter million miles away Earth looks like a bright ball in space. It's not terribly different from the way the Moon looks to us. The first images of the Earth from the Moon came from the Apollo mission. Apollo 8 in 1968 was the first human spaceflight to leave Earth's orbit. It was the first earthly spacecraft to be captured by and escape from the gravitational field of another celestial body, in this case the Moon. It was the first voyage in which humans visited another world and returned to Earth. This is what Earth looks from Mercury. On May 6, 2010, NASA's Messenger spacecraft captured an image of the Earth and Moon, while it was 114 million miles from Earth. This is what Earth looks from Mars orbit. The image of Earth from Mars was the first shot of our planet from another. The image was taken using the Higher Resolution Imaging Science Experiment camera on October 3, 2007, from 88 million miles from Earth. The image only shows half of the Earth and Moon, because the phase angle was 98 degrees and, therefore, only illuminated half of the disks. This is what Earth looks like from the surface of Mars. NASA's Curiosity rover on Mars has captured its first view of Earth from the surface of the Red Planet, a striking image that shows our home planet as a bright light in the Martian sky, with the moon shining nearby. The Curiosity rover photographed Earth from Mars, using the left eye camera on its head-like science mast. A human observer with normal vision, if standing on Mars, could easily see Earth and the moon as two distinct bright evening stars. This is what Earth looks through Saturn's rings. Cassini took the third shot of Earth from another planet was taken from Saturn on July 19, 2013, from 898 million miles away. The tiny blue dot is visible under Saturn's main rings, the F, G, and E rings. This image was also the first time we knew in advance that Earth would be imaged from another planet. From beyond Neptune, also known as the pale blue dot, this image was the first ever portrait of the solar system. Voyager 1 took a total of 60 frames to create a mosaic of the solar system from a record distance of about 4 billion miles away on February 14, 1990. Earth's tiny blue dot, barely the size of a pixel, can be seen in the center of one of the light rays, which was caused by taking the image so close to the sun. Voyager 1 was on its way out of the solar system after completing its mission of studying the outer solar system, when NASA, at the request of Carl Sagan, commanded it to turn its cameras around and take one last picture of Earth and the vast solar system. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you like the video then make sure to subscribe to our channel.